Hi, good morning. My name is Selena and I am a gestational carrier or also known as a surrogate. Uh, today I'm going to be doing my first progesterone and oil shot. So my PIO shot. Um, I'm a little bit nervous. I've done the injections so I know how to do them and I'm getting used to them. This one's a little bit different because it is oil. And so I've heard it's a little bit different, so I'll show you a little bit of things that I do different today, and uh, hopefully it goes well. Okay, so first, I'm gonna get my drawing needle. This one is a little bit different because the uh, needle is actually already attached, and it's a much thicker um, syringe than the other ones, you can see the difference in the syringe between the one I need to do today and the ones I've been doing. And this one already has the needle attached. Um, and then, and then I'm getting my, same thing as before, my injection needle. And then this is what my progesterone and oil shot came in. There you go. Wow, that is big. Okay, so this is what the bottle looks like. Let me take the top off here. It's got like foil and like a little sticker protecting the top. There you go, looks kind of like the shots I've been doing. So same thing, I'm going to alcohol swab the top, so nothing different than I was doing before. Um, and I need 0.5 cc's, so that's half. So I like to kind of loosen up the plunger. So there you go, that's half of a cc. So same thing, I'm gonna take that off. I'm gonna poke it inside and I'm gonna push the air in. And then I'm gonna draw out. Oops. So I pushed all the air in. And then I'm gonna draw in the progesterone and oil. So I did half. back on and then I'm gonna pull back the syringe so all of the medicine gets out of the needle and put that in my sharps container uh, so one of the things they say to do is take this and like put it like either under your armpit or in your thighs or in between your boobs somewhere to kind of warm up the oil so it's not so thick when it goes in um, so I will probably do that for about 10 minutes only because I'm also waiting for the numbing cream um, that I put on that I showed in my other video. Um, so hopefully we'll get this a little bit warmer so it won't be so thick. So we'll try that and then I'll come back and then show you what I do. Okay, so I have been heating this in my armpit for like 10 minutes so I'm ready. So, I'm going to stick on the injection needle. Okay, so I'm going to push the syringe up to the half mark. Make sure the bubbles come up at the top. And you see the little drop that came out, so that's good. Looks pretty numb. In. Let's push 
check the plunger a little bit, make sure there's no blood. There's not. Okay. Hopefully this goes in easy. Okay, so did I get it all? Yeah. So I'll put those in my shirt container. Okay, the next thing I'm going to do is heat this up. This is like a rice pack. So because it's oil, I want it to get into the muscle really good. So I'm going to heat this up. So I got this heating bat bag off Etsy. It's so cute. It looks like a pineapple, which is good luck for um, surrogacy. So I bought it because I thought it was super cute and I can use it every day. Now I'm going to, I'll probably just keep that on there for a couple minutes. Okay, so thank you for watching. Um, it was pretty easy. I didn't have difficulty pushing the syringe with the oil. So I think that's because I heated it under my armpit. And then now I'm massaging it with the rice pack, the heated rice pack. So um, I'll do a little bit of a follow up tomorrow to tell you if it's like more sore than, than the other injections. So thank you for watching. Bye guys.